Well, let's take you through some of the tributes, and there have been many, many thousands coming in. These are some of the uh, best known. We've got Gary Lineker, who's tweeted, Pele has died, the most divine of footballers and joyous of men. He played a game only a few chosen ones have come close to. Three times he lifted the most coveted gold trophy in that beautiful yellow shirt he may have left us, but he'll always have footballing immortality. R.I.P. Pele. Jeff Hurst tweeted, I've so many memories of Pele, without doubt the best footballer I ever played against, with Bobby Moore being the best footballer I ever played alongside. For me, Pele remains the greatest of all time and I was proud to be on the pitch with him. R.I.P. Pele. And thank you, that from Sir Jeff Hurst. And the former England player Michael Owen tweeted, a sad day for football around the world, Brazilian legend and three times World Cup winner Pele has passed away at the age of 82. Rest in peace, Edson Arantes do Nascimento. That's, uh, of course, Pele's full name. Usain Bolt simply tweeted a sporting legend. Rest in peace, King Pele. And Cristiano Ronaldo posted on Instagram, my deepest condolences to all of Brazil and in particular to the family of Mr Edson Arantes do Nascimento. A mere goodbye to the eternal King Pele will never be enough to express the pain that currently embraces the entire world of football. Ronaldo continued by saying, an inspiration so many millions, a reference from yesterday to today, forever. The affection he always showed for me was reciprocal in every moment we shared, even from a distance. He will never be forgotten and his memory will live on forever in each of us football lovers. Rest in peace, King Pele.